Uh, this is a lifelong career for me because it's something that will always be needed. It's never going to go away. We're the biggest mold manufacturers in North America. It's actually enriched my life outside of work because if I have something break on my truck, I know how to fix it. You know, I can, if it's a part that's pretty simple, I can make it myself, you know. Being able to see parts that you've made outside of work being sold on a store shelf or something, that's really cool. That's something that's pretty specific to this trade. To be honest, and it may sound corny, but this is the, one of the first jobs out of many I've had in 40 years that I'm actually, you know, I get up and I'm excited to come here. I'm Brandon Descent, uh, I'm a machinist here at Lakeland Mold. Joe Mossberg, been here for about five years, started in the finish shop, moved to a machinist now. Uh, my name is Matt Rutsky, uh, I've been here for about six months uh, in the pattern shop. My name is Rob Brown, uh, I've been with Lakeland Mold for one year now and I am a manufacturing engineer. Um, I design and program parts for CNC uh, mill. I went to school at uh, CLC in Staples uh, through the machine trades program. Moved up here right after high school for college for welding and uh, got a job here as a finisher. There's opportunities everywhere from one department to another. If something opens up, you can just transfer and give it a shot and see what you think. Because of what we're able to do nowadays, uh, they're getting an extremely high quality part at uh, less cost because we can do it more efficiently. When I started, uh, designs were done on a drafting board with pencil, paper, and then um, after that, the computers came in and they would do things in a wire frame. Now I know that they actually have virtual rooms where you can be inside the part, and it's remarkable in 20 years what they've done. Within the last 10 years, it's made leaps and bounds. What you can do with a machine tool now is just unheard of from what you could do in the past. I mean, you can hold tolerances of less than one-tenth of a human hair all day long. I wouldn't have been able to start anywhere else, you know, for what they're paying me to start out with. Part of the field that I really like is the challenges. Um, they do throw some stuff out there that you think that might be pretty hard to get through, but once you do, you know, you're pretty, pretty proud of what you did. I love my job. It's, uh, it's always something different every day. The people I work with are amazing. Um, we have a lot of fun at work. And then uh, the work itself, um, you know, I've, I've made everything from kayaks to school desks. Uh, seeing parts that you make. I mean, I've seen uh, tanks and boats that I've had something to do with, and you know, that's really cool. You take a lot of ownership in your job. Mm -hmm.